Hi, I'm Sean Gannon, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about evaluating limits. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help to use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, the limit as x approaches a negative 3 from the left of 2x over x plus 3, and we have to find the limit here. So there's a few ways to kind of go about this. We can use a table, and we can type in some, or put in some values that approach negative 3 from the left. So if we did that, we have x over y, and let's put in values that approach negative 3 from the left. If we put negative 4 in, we would get an 8. If we put a negative 3.5 in for x, we get a 14. And a negative 3.01 in for x, we get a 602. Those are pretty large values as we get closer and closer to negative 3, and we're approaching from the left-hand side. And we can see that this limit is going to be probably approaching infinity. But why? Well, when we're dividing here by what's going to be approaching a zero, right, as negative 3 goes in for x, we're dividing by zero. So if we approach from the left, really what happens here? And I like to do this little exercise. I pick a value just to the left of negative 3, negative 3.1, and plug that in for x, negative 3.1 here. And I have negative 3.1 plus 3. And all I'm caring about here is, well, we know it's going to go to infinity, but it's, is it positive or negative? And I'm caring about, is the final result positive or negative? Well, the numerator, 2 times a, or positive times a negative, is a negative. Negative 3.1 plus a 3 comes out to still be a negative value. And negative divided by negative is a positive. So from our table and from our knowledge about limits here, as we approach, right, um, negative 3 when we're dividing by like a 0, we would say that this limit is equal to a positive infinity, and that is our final answer. I hope this video was helpful for you, and if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute math, minute math, when you need help you use minute math.